Hello again and welcome back to the card mat. A nice one you can use as an icebreaker or as a lead into any effect you know that uses well four of a kind I suppose. You could have four cards selected and do it from there I suppose as well. Right. As it's to do with four of a kind I'm going to need four of a kind and I shall go for the, the little ladies why not? I'll get a bit of glamour. Everybody uses the aces. We only use the four ladies. Dinky dinky doo. Dinky dinky da. And there's the last one. So we've got the four queens. The queen of clubs, the queen of hearts, the queen of spades and the queen of diamonds. Possibly in that order but I could not be certain. Shall we have a look? Queen of clubs, queen of hearts, queen of spades. Queen of Diamonds. Okay, so the Aces did want to get in on it in the end. I can still make this work. We will use the four Aces instead to do the trick. About there, I think, we will stick one of the Aces in and see what card we end up getting by. And we end up getting by that one. Get the pack around. With the right foot. Oh, I knew I should have put a bend in the packet. I should have done that now. Mm, I'm giving the game away. Good job I'm going to be telling it in a minute. Then we'll get the other ace and that, go, that can go in about there. So we've got the other ace about there and we'll take whatever card comes along with that. And that looks like it's a better break there. So we'll go with that. The ace of spades, mm, that one's about there, the ace of spades, and that will take a card as well, there's the break, just there. Now, last one, the ace of diamonds, Ooh, he wants to get in about there, so we've got the ace of diamonds and they'll take that card. Now, the ace of clubs found the queen of clubs, the heart. I did say a nice way to lead into a four of a kind trick. I mean, there you go, you've got soul. You know what I mean. You can go into something a bit more elaborate if you know something a bit more elaborate. Right, how's it done? How's it done? I had it in chased order, as you could see. So, chased order. Put whatever four cards you want somewhere into the packet. All in different places. Hopefully not too near the top. For the simple reason, these are going to go on the top in the same order. But, advisable, put a crimp in a corner or bend the cards and bend your packet. Put a bend in your packet and put a bend in your pieces just so you can get a nice good break underneath them in a minute. When you turn it over to say you're going to be using four of a kind you got your nice little break there which you can quite easily go bing and get that pinky in there before you start a good idea as well is just to pull them back slightly in your hand just slightly just so that they don't pop out funny at the top as they might have done in that little performance because i forgot to pull them back but don't tell anybody and then you go through the packet and you look for the four cards you're going to use. In this case, the four queens. And now you're going to use a thing called Vernon's Add-on Move. Where you've got all of them, like that, bing, bang, bing. You've got your little pinky break down there, bing, bang, bing. You'll straighten them up, kick them to the side. Grab the packet at that corner and at the bottom, pull them cards up underneath to meet up with them. So from there, you pull them straight up underneath them till they all line up at the top. You pull them up till it comes up to your finger and stops them. Pull them all out and straight away drop the packet on the top. Turn over and say you put the four queens down. Clubs. Hearts, spades, and diamonds, because you know it's in chased order. Right, so we've got the club, the heart, the spade, 
the diamond. No, mm, wrong. Take the glove. You can even get them to put it in wherever they want you in the packet. Put it in about there. Okay. So you're going to put that in. We'll take the card that you've gone to. And now you're doing um, Mexican block turnover. Where you'll put that card in, pull everything out, keeping that card on the bottom, pulling the top card towards yourself. Flip the packet, keeping hold of the top card, and take them two cards away and put them down. And you just take one of the queens. Now this is where you need to bend your pack. You'll get a natural break. Make it a damn sight easier for turning the pack over where the join is. And because you don't want to turn it over and do that. Flash a queen. So it makes it nice and easy for you to grab the packet and flip it. And take the next one. Get them to shove that in wherever they want. Do the same thing. Pull it to the side. Push it flush. Pick up. Pull to the edge. Peel top card. Flip packet. Pick cards up. Put cards down. Natural break. Think right at the top. Bump and over. These go nearer the middle. Same procedure. Push in. Pull down. Pull card. Flip pack. Pick up. Put down. Natural break. Turn over. And obviously for the last one, well, you know the idea. You end up with the top card. And then you turn over to do your big reveal and the all match. There you go. And I say you can do that and then say you scrap off the queens. Bye bye me. Little lady. And do uh, twisting the aces or something. Choice is yours. But there we go. Just a very nice quick one. I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope you can use it. Thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you again soon.